from the Epson L3110. We have here what we call the uh, pickup roller, which had an issue wherein um, the, the printer turns red for an error in it whenever it is uh, being turned on. So uh, we will explain what happened. Hello and good day, welcome everyone, welcome to my channel and today we will discuss about the functions of the pickup roller and the roller feeder of our printer. So uh, this is very important because uh, this performs the functions of uh, feeding the paper from the tray to the printer itself. So there are times that the printer could not pick up the paper because there is an issue on either of this the pickup roller or the feeder roller or both of them so uh, in this case from the epson l3110 we have here what we call the uh, pickup roller which had an issue wherein um, the, the printer turns red for an error in it whenever it is uh, being turned on so uh, we will explain what happened. So this is a set of the printer feeder of Epson L3110. Um, this is the set. No, uh, we have this feeder, its rubber, and also the uh, gear, the roller as a, as a gear. And as you can see here, we have here the spring. Because uh, this spring, this spring allows this uh, as it to uh, rotate in just only one direction okay something like this so as you can see so it will just only rotate in one direction so the problem with this uh, feeder roller is uh, we have a broken gear so as you can see here the gear has been damaged the reason why the printer could not fit the paper properly so what we did is or was to buy a replacement for this one so it will work okay so we have a new one the old one will be replaced by this something new so another problem sometimes why the paper could not be uh, fed it's because of the rubber on its pickup feeder so uh, we have here as you can see it becomes thin thinner than the original one and as you can see um, it becomes smoother the reason why it could not pick up the paper so in order to fix the issue is of course we need to replace this part of this uh, feeder roller so uh, to illustrate how to install the new parts for this printer let's go and watch this and uh, by the way if you are new to my channel uh, please don't forget to subscribe or and also hit the notification bell for new video updates that we'll have soon so let's go let's watch how we can install this in the printer Okay, so today we will perform how to disassemble this Epson L3110. We will be removing this scanner unit at the top to expose the internal parts of this printer. So before that, we need our tools. So most importantly, we will need to use a Phillips screwdriver. So we have two screws here, one on this side and the other one on this side. So we just need to unscrew this one, followed by the other. And uh, when we disassemble this type of printer, it's just very easy because we only need to unscrew two screws here. So right after that, we need to lift it up slightly and we will try to turn this side so that you can see. Okay, so we need to lift lightly and then pull here. So that we can expose these parts and then we need to remove 
the flex cables here. No, we have three. And right after that, push slightly on this side to remove this one. And there you go. We have opened the printer. Now the printer is open, we will assemble these parts. So first, we'll use this one, the new one. So we will install this one right there, this uh, guide there, then the spring will be placed here. We can do this to, do this way. Don't forget the spring for the sensor. Thank you. 